again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And this won't be a big help to everyone, but it might be. And uh, somebody posted this drawing on a Facebook page and they couldn't get it to weld. It's, it's three different, four different items, but the welding tool will not weld the poly line. So you can go weld and it didn't really do anything. There's two ways to do this that I know of. One, you've drawn this out, but you want to check a couple of things. If that happens when you're color filling, if it doesn't if it leaks out to the other portions of your drawing, you've got a leak somewhere. So to do that, you need to make sure your poly lines are connected. And as you can see, they're not quite connected or not quite connected good enough. So one way you can do that is just to grab that line. And when you see it node, click on there. that means it's connected. So I've already done this one. So let's check it with the polyline and fill it in. And it's still a little leak somewhere. So you need to maybe check your corners. But anyway, so I've got this one done and you can see it, it doesn't leak or what I call leak. So there's a couple ways you can do this. One, just lasso all of them and go to create a boundary and there you have the shape that this person was wanting. Or you can use your color fill again, fill in all the items, select all the items. So you've already got the box selected. Hold down your shift key and select all three items. Move it out of the way. Put right click, no outline. Let's make it black now. And now it's welded together. Let's move it over here. Right click your or left click your mouse for no fill. Right click your mouse for outline. So there the, the weld tool worked, but it took a couple steps. So a lot easier sometimes maybe to just use the boundary tool. Thank you for watching and hope that helped a little bit.